a plant gang, Ophiopogon planus capus nigrescens, the black mondo grass, which is right here in front of me. Uh, this is a great uh, little uh, plant to add to the garden, especially for the color contrast. I don't know of uh, uh, many other plants that really approach as dark a foliage as this plant has. So this Ophiopogon, although it looks like a grass, it is not a true grass. We'll say that it's a grass-like uh, member of the lily family. Uh, great, uh, beautiful, dark foliage. Uh, you may uh, hear this called mondo grass, black mondo grass. Uh, herbaceous perennial, hardy from zone six through nine. Uh, zone six, it gets a little bit wishy-washy with its hardiness, and so you have to be a little bit careful. Probably best to spring plant in zone six and zone seven. Uh, but above that, it does really well. Uh, really, the hotter zone you get into, you probably need to move this into a little bit more shade. Really does appreciate an afternoon shade type situation, uh, and that's where it's really going to thrive. So this plant really does look the best when it is used in contrast with other different color foliage plants, uh, different color blooms where you can really show off uh, the dark color of this plant. One foot high, one foot wide spreading out from the base. Where it's happy it'll continue to spread out. Uh, here we've got it next to another uh, mondo grass with, with gold in it. Uh, and it, the color contrast looks uh, really good. Again, thrives in an afternoon shade type situation. Here's a landscape tip. Used for its unique color, plant in partial shade in well-drained soil.